All right, guys, so the next uh, deke I'm going to show you, I call it uh, the L1 Quick Deke. Um, here's what it looks like. Kind of shifts you to the left a little bit, and you can, of course, go the other way also. This is a very simple deke. Um, I don't use it too often, but here's how you do it. You can see my sticks on the bottom right. You just hold L1, and then to go this way, you tap to the left with the left stick. Notice my right stick isn't even doing anything. You don't need that for this deke. And then to go the other way, hold L1 and press the left stick to the right. Um, like I said, I don't use this deke very often. I feel like compared to, to windmill dekes, they just aren't as good. I, I think this deke is used best when combined with other dekes, which is by itself, I feel like it's really nothing special. Um, and here's one of the issues I have with it. So you can see there, it was a pretty standard, normal puck pickup. Looks fine. But look at this one. So I do the deke, and then look at how long he takes to pick it up. I hate that. And it seems to be about, maybe a little less than 50% of the time you get it like that. And it, it can really fuck you up. So here's Rob using it on a breakaway. And then here, see, he gets that awkward pickup. But uh, like I said, when combined with other dekes, and here he does it between the legs deke after, and uh, that's beautiful. And here again, in combination, cuts to the outside with it, cuts back in, and then uses, uses it between the legs deke to cut back out. So uh, there's a lot of different ways you can combine dekes, and this is definitely one of those dekes that you can kind of throw into the middle of a combination and, and have work for you.